Okay, so if you've recently installed the October 2020 update, also known as version 2009 or 20H2, you might have noticed that this system window has disappeared. When you go to control panel and uh, try and open it, which I will do, so go to control panel and uh, let's try and open system so we scroll down double click system and what we actually get is the new about menu come up instead of the system menu so there is a way around it there is a way of getting back to the system menu I mean you can get to some of the items in the system menu just by clicking on this advanced system settings just over on the right here and this takes you to uh, all these details just here but this guide shows you how to set up an icon on your desktop to get you back into the classic system. So first of all, find an empty space on your desktop and then click the right mouse button, the button on the right hand side of the mouse. Once you've done that, a menu should come up. Go down to new and then go across and down slightly to shortcut and left click once. You'll then get this create shortcut box appear. In there, you need to type in this box under type the location of the item. You need to type this explorer.exe space shell. Then you want three colons and open squiggly lines. Capital B for Bravo, capital B for Bravo, 06, capital C for Charlie, 0, E for Echo, and that's a capital, 4, hyphen capital D for Delta 293 hyphen 4 small f for Freddy 75 hyphen 8 capital A for Alpha 90 hyphen capital C for Charlie capital B for Bravo 05 capital B for Bravo 64 77 capital E, capital E, capital E. Those are E for echoes and then close squiggly line. What I'll do is I will put this um, in the description of the video so you can copy and paste it. Once you've typed that in, move your mouse over next, left click once, and then we want to give it a name. So just call it classic system. And then we move our mouse over finish, left click once, and then you'll get this here, this classic system. Now, this is this part is optional. We can right click on here and go down to properties and we can go change icon to change the icon. So left click change icon, and like I say, this bit is optional. And then we can select another icon, like for instance, this picture of a computer here, double click on that, left click apply, left click okay, and there you go, it gives you a classic icon. Um, you can move this anywhere you like on the screen, double click on it and as you will see you will get the classic system screen come back on your system. I hope this guide helps and thanks very much for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech, that's at CWTech on Twitter and don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel, just Google Chris Wait YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.